is a generic data extraction table that all of you should kind of have. Yeah. So pick up the paper. The, what are the problems uh, this particular paper is dealing with? So it could be about thermal comfort. It could be about or I can't think of some other uh, problem. Uh, maybe it's about natural lighting, acoustics, and so on. Okay. So this would be the broad problem, and then you would see there could be multiple studies that are addressing this concept. Okay. So for example, study one, two thousand twenty. Study two, two thousand twenty-one, and so on. Yeah. Similarly here, similarly here, and could be many more. All right. So by doing this, what we have done is come up with initial themes of how you are going to group or categorize your literature. Okay. So we are categorizing it based upon four things here: thermal comfort, energy efficiency, natural lighting, uh, natural lighting, and acoustics. So for each study, we can then go and study or find out how they have solved this problem. You know. So what is their unique approach? What was their methodology? Did they do simulations? Did they do quantitative study? Did they do qualitative study? Was it mixed? So you can mention that. Okay. Uh, here you can then, depending upon what approach it is, you can give a summary of the data collection. So maybe 150 surveys or 20 interviews. Yeah. Then we talk about their findings. If this was the problem, or if there was a sub problem in this uh, broad heading, what did they find, or how did they solve? So how did they solve is the contribution. So they built a simulation model, or they built a framework architecture for doing something for solving the problem. Okay, so this is their contribution, empirical contribution. Okay, when they build something, for example, in this case, it may be a house that they built uh, that is thermally comfortable. So, what did they find? The house temperature reduced on an average by two degrees or five degrees. In summer, yeah. To do this thing, to assess this, how it was done, did they run any experiments, or did they do any simulations? If they have done something, you can mention that here. In future work, did they mention anything special? You know, uh, what should be done next? So this kind of a table, initial data extraction table of this form, sort. will be the starting point for you and then you can in fact create multiple tables based upon this table itself so for example there could be a table on future work just a table on future work just a table on say methodology where you where you group different studies based upon the methodology that they have used uh, so this and this can go in that table uh, you can also create a table based upon the findings or based upon the experimental setup so a lot of things that you there are a lot of things that you can do when you do uh, data extra, uh, data extraction and the ideas that you will get for developing these tables would evolve as you start collecting this information 